All right, guys, this is Deepen Gogoi, Technical Analyst of Allies Blue. So, in this video, I will discuss about Bank Nifty. And now you can see this is a Bank Nifty daily time frame. And if you want to see here, in a Bank Nifty daily chart, uh, we, have seen, uh, we have seen the seller momentum are reducing, right? Like that. So, here you can see seller momentum are there. And price push up again there. Like that, right? So that means when uh, when we see like that, that means here last mom, uh, seller momentum uh, slowly they are decreasing, right? And the buyer are increasing right now. So when they are forming, uh, we are expecting that the price will go up, but still not confirmed, right? So we are expecting that it's. So let's check it in a daily time frame. Uh, sorry, four hour time frame, but. Uh, just a minute in a daily time frame uh, if you want to see yesterday candle they are forming hanging man and uh, the criteria is that hanging man you can see uh, this was bullish candle and after that uh, yesterday price just pushed down but not able to sustain uh, in the lower point and again price push up right that means buyer are dominating now in a daily time frame and uh, today you can see just open and price up uh, uh, price are pushing up that uh, upside right so for our time frame uh, it will look like that and I told they are trying to create a double bottom so <coughs> sorry double bottom right or W pattern and according to moving average price are still running down right moving average uh, all moving average are arranging sequently but if you wanna see here in this zone, all moving averages are becoming uh, like uh, each closer each other, right? So when they are forming this type of, so it is we are recognized as a sideways market, or you can say side shoppy market. Now we are expecting to break this level because here we have seen this is our neckline. So here higher point again push down and again trying to break this level. This is a higher point, so. Uh, we drawn it as a resistant line of 28977 that is our resistant line now let's check it in a small time frame like a 15 minute for our entry and exit how it should look like and then now you can see just a minute and then now you can see price just a following moving average uh, this is 100 right have you seen and according to the price action method, in a small time frame, they are creating higher high and a higher low. So, if you want to see here, right now they are following moving average, uh, 100 moving average, and price is bouncing from there at that area. So, in that case, what, what trading strategy today we are going to use? So today I want to trade breakout trading strategy. So what is the breakout trading strategy? Uh, now you can see in a four hour time frame we have seen this is a neckline. Right. So if they break this neckline or resistance line, so I will start buying. That is called breakout trading strategy. They broke this neckline, sorry, neckline and or you can say like resistance line. And at that time, they will break this 200 moving average so that means they are breaking three things one is support sorry resistant second 200 moving average third neckline right neckline that means this is called neckline w pattern and this is the neckline so for the buy we have seen above 289980 eight, above right above this area I will start buying this is called breakout trading strategy for the buy so before you enter in this market always find out the trading strategy what trading strategy you are going to use today right so like here we have seen this is bounce back trading strategy price just run pull up and toward this 200 moving uh, sorry 20 moving every second push down right again push up which are acting as a resistance and then that is our sell entry market boom that is called 
bounce back to the strategy. So again push up, again bounce. Sell here because bounce back to the strategy and the same similarly like that. Right? Here something like that. Same. When price is pushing upside toward this resistance, uh, again we are entering there for uh, sell. Right? So that is called bounce back trading strategy. But today we are going to trade by using breakout trading strategy. Right? Okay. So especially we use that type of. Especially I use uh, uh, mostly right three type trading strategy I use and hardly sometime I use uh, like maximum five. Uh, trading strategy I use sometime I will discuss what strategy I using uh, like uh, during my trade right so I already told you two strategy one is uh, bounce back trading strategy that is called uh, like here you can see sell 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 here sell short only because in that case we are never going to take buy right and uh, now we have seen in this area we have seen Mm. Uh, trend line breaking uh, breaking straight is right here and the next let me show you for the buy and for the sell because remember uh, for the sell why I'm talking like for the sell because in this zone we never seen any sell opportunity because this trend is totally downtrend when during the downtrend we are only taking sell position and uptrend when they are placing uptrend and we are start only buying right we buy only we never take any sell position and remember in a shopping market or sideway market if you want to trade but it is very dangerous for uh, option uh, call put buyer right due to <coughs> time decay so now we can see if you want to trade in this area uh, like uh, when price is soppy like that uh, when they are running in a zone so in that case we are using um, trend line breaking strategy like today we have seen if they break this level so we will start buying and till this area right and if they break this supporting line so we will start selling there right we already discussed uh, where is our entry point for the buy and uh, let's check it for the sell now we have seen price creating higher high and higher low in in this area i'm not talking this area because this area still they are not able to break right now you can see they are creating like this higher high and higher low and uh, let me draw a supporting line by connecting this uh, most recent lower and higher one have you seen right now let me zoom it okay cool now we have seen this is uh, our entry and exit point so above this area 28980 uh, we will start buying but this area we never gonna take any buy and sell position because we never know because market is in a sideway right in a sideway market we can't say in which direction market will go that they will go up or it will go down we never know nobody doesn't right so in that case we are looking for some support and a resistance now as a support we have seen here lower point lower point i just connected three uh, most recent lower point and i drawn a supporting line and we have seen this is a support and now you can see this is a supporting zone so if you wanna take sell position so we will start selling below this supporting line so you can say like uh, 28450 uh, somewhere here like that and for the buy we are looking for above 28980 that is our buy and this area called no traded zone right so i hope you enjoyed this video if you like this video please like and subscribe thanks for watching